Hey guys, Dcat here with another YouTube video, and today we are going to be talking about Worlds Adrift, the new closed beta that came out just yesterday, and today we will be discussing the importance of the grappling hook, and how you can avoid being such a scrub that I am. I mean, seriously, I just went from nearly full health to 30, so yeah. Extremely important tools, but you have to know how to use it properly. I wish I could say that I'm a master and can just uh, pull everything off perfect, but obviously not. I was trying to do that without avoiding damage, or with avoiding damage completely and utterly, but obviously that did not work. So yeah, as you first join in, you will spawn into a spawn room. It's, um rather interesting place just a deep hole that you can only get out from by using your uh, grappling hook yeah you can only get out of it by using your grappling hook with a right click to uh, shoot left shift only to uh, pull yourself into your hook right shift does not work as you can see neither is right control but left control allows you to move yourself down and you can use all sorts of incredibly useful things with the grappling hook for example getting onto your ship just shoot up to your sail and you can just fly around your ship as much as you want oh geez that does that looked crazy. And you can just drop yourself on your ship, get in, and take off. Or if you're trying to... Or if your ship is not that well made like mine is right now, it is a pain to get it anywhere without your hook. Like getting in to repair my Atlas uh, flight thingy. I don't remember the name off the top of my head. It's the... Um, it is the uh, Skycore, Atlas Skycore. But not only that, you can use your grappling hook to get around the islands you're on. So if I drop down, I can shoot the... Uh, I can shoot the side of this island, work my way up the sides, maybe discover a cave or two. Because, oh my god, what you can find on, this, on these islands is pretty incredible but we don't need to go looking around the cave right now although your grappling hook is really useful for that as well you just shoot wherever you need to go fly around launch yourself up hopefully you don't drop yourself off the edge of the world but if you do hopefully you can recover with you all well, your grappling hook but another very important thing you can do with the grappling hook other than just fly yourself around these worlds Oh, wow. That's a cool section of the uh, world I did not even know about. So yeah, it allows you to find out a lot. But you can... Alt one thing that I didn't know until attempting to re record this video is you can actually shoot your grappling hook onto the wildlife and fly around with the wildlife. So, if I can get up here, I can show you a quick example of that. But another really important and cool uh, detail we can uh, discuss is the use of the grappling hook plus your jump ability to break your hook and send you flying. It can really launch you in locations that you'd find really unexpected expecting or if you get find yourself in a situation like I am about to get myself in right now I've fallen in here I've um, already collected all useful um, knowledge from this location trying to fix my uh, knowledge thing there we go so I can't do anything anymore so I shoot myself up and just my normal left shift ends up killing me. So now I need to head back down to get more my stuff back. 
And actually, this idea, one of the really important things with the grappling hook is, as you can saw, I just use my grappling hook to get up normally. I have, I didn't try anything special to uh, get up, and I ended up suffocating. People do that all the time. Just earlier today, I found so much loot in this uh, one hole. Just act that I accidentally found. I was just looking for knowledge, and then I saw this, and I'm like, okay, that's cool. Drops down. Holy crap. Actually, you can see several bags down here still. And this is actually a new bag. So I'll take what's in there, grab the stuff I lost just now. And, well, I'm stuck in here. What can I do? I can't, um, just climb out. Actually, I might be able to climb out, but... Yeah, I might be able to work my way out, but it's too slow, and I've quite- I've actually found climbing to be quite buggy and ends up killing me more than it should. So what I ended up- so what I end up doing is shooting close to my way- just shooting my way up towards the exit. Obviously, I can't shoot my way up because there's nothing to really hook onto. But... If I can pull this off and shoot the side real close, I can grapple up as close as I can, jump, breaking my grapple, and landing right next to it. So I'm out here, and I am free to go collect any resources I need. For example, this bronze, which just so happened to have re just responded. That's nice. So, you can use uh, grapples to- your grapples with your jump button to help you get through really hard to reach areas. Or get out of uh, areas you manage to trap yourself in, like I did there. But, as I mentioned earlier, you can actually grapple off of wildlife. Like this. I... I'm not sure of any use grappling to these guys can do quite yet, but I don't know. Maybe you guys are more creative than me and can figure out how to fly around. Oh, God! And can figure out how to just fly around, maybe attack a ship or two by somehow controlling these creatures. I don't know. It's pretty cool. It can definitely allow you to get up to islands if they just happen to fly by them. Like, I'm sure if I can swing... Ow. Well. That didn't work. But yeah, I'm sure you guys can figure out better ways to uh, send yourself uh, around the world with your grappling hook than I have. Really nice, really useful, and it's quite honestly extremely fun. But yep, that will be it for this video, guys. I hope you learned a thing or two that you didn't know before. I certainly learned a few things making this video that I didn't know earlier. But yep, that's going to be it for now, and I'll see you guys next time. If you have any ideas of what you want the next video topic to be on, just let me know in the comment section. It could be about building your ship, making it be as shitty as mine right now, or as well made or actually I can't really say well made yet because I haven't checked out their new ship since they've got briefed yeah looks like they're doing it doing a fairly good job or as well made as this ship over here with metal plating and stuff pretty nice pretty nice still a work in progress but if yeah you guys got it but yep that's going to be it for now guys this is Dcat signing off Bye!